Hey guys, welcome to my channel. As you can see, it's me, Maimuna, back here with my hijabi doll aesthetic. <laughs> feels so good to just get out of bed and do a whole glow up. This glow up took me literally 30 minutes. I was watching this get ready with me. Sabina Hanan quarantine glam. Getting ready is so much nicer when you actually have someone to get ready with. So like having like a virtual get ready with me buddy makes you feel a little bit less alone. Speaking of glowing up, today's video is going to be about glowing up during Ramadan. Ramadan is fast approaching. I believe we're gonna start tomorrow. I'm gonna be fasting. It's the perfect time to set some goals, start some new habits and just kind of improve yourself and improve your mind and your body and your spiritual connection with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So I wanted to do a video discussing my Ramadan glow up goals with all of you maybe to inspire you and even open up your mind to the possibility of adopting some of these glow up Goal. We're all gonna be doing Ramadan in lockdown sadly and making the most of this time is challenging for a few of us Especially if we're not the types that do well on our own I know many of us can be like that where loneliness can affect you and it can get to you and it can make you less motivated in doing things that are actually beneficial and helpful <sighs> But you're not alone. Okay, we're all in this boat. So I'm gonna talk to you guys about all my glow up plans so I'm gonna split it up into three so I've got my mental glow up so what am I learning what habits am I gonna start doing to improve myself during Ramadan but the physical glow up which is what am I gonna do for my health what am I gonna do for my body and then the third one is spiritual glow up so what am I doing to bring myself closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the first of my goals, which is my mental glow up, is going to come out of me learning a hobby. So because 2020 is the year of hobbies, thanks to being stuck indoors and having no choice but to pick up a hobby, one type of hobby that I'm really interested in learning is baking cakes. And I love baking. Um, admittedly, I am terrible at it, but I want to improve and I want to level up on my skills. And so you may be seeing a few baking videos on my channel. I'm just going to focus on one hobby. I know there's a bazillion other hobbies I could pick up, but I like baking. Second glow up, which is the physical glow up, is I'm going to focus on building healthy eating habits. I'm very, very interested in nutrition and especially metabolism. I think that's one of the things I've kind of opened my mind up to more is the idea of metabolism and how you can control your metabolism based on what you eat and how you move. And so the funny thing is the most challenging thing to our metabolism this month is going to be Ramadan because you're not going to be doing anything for the majority of the day. Like you're not eating so you're going to be tired and you might want to lie down in your bed or chill on your sofa but that can take a hit on your metabolism that can bring your energy levels down i don't know if it's just me but many of us have gone through a lot of damage internally because of the way we we eat so it could be you either eat a lot and your metabolism is slowed down because your body doesn't recognize when it's full or it could be you starved yourself for years and years and now your metabolism is extremely slow and no matter how much you eat, you're going to gain weight. There has to be a solution to this problem. One of the things that I think is really going to help me and it's already really helped me is installing my fitness pal. Now this is the app, my fitness pal. Now what I do with this app is I just put in what I eat. Okay, I don't pick low calorie foods and I don't pick foods that you know, are meant to make me lose weight. I just put what I eat. So if I tend to eat a sandwich for breakfast or if I tend to eat a chocolate bar as a snack, I put it in. It helps me analyze my eating patterns and it helps me realize if I'm eating too less or if I'm eating just right or if I'm eating too much. And what I've realized is I've actually been eating way, way less than I'm supposed to. And that's why my energy levels have been so low. But because I've kind of realized that, I've been able to bring my energy levels back up. And so, as you can tell, I'm super enthusiastic. I have so much energy. And the last one is spiritual glow up. So what am I going to do to make myself closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? It's good to have 
simple goals. Some people just go overboard and they, and they start thinking, oh, I'm going to read the entire Quran, I'm going to memorize like five surahs, and I'm going to memorize the tafsir of these five surahs, and then I'm going to go pray like 10 rakat tarawih every day, and I'm going to learn Arabic, I'm going to do all these crazy things all in one go. You have 30 days, you need to make the most of 30 days, and you need to do things that provide a lot of value for what they are. If you overburden your plate, you're going to be struggling to keep up with your goals. And you might even fall off the bandwagon. I'm going to pick two goals, two things, and they're going to be really simple. So the first one is going to be, try to understand my Lord, uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, through his 99 names. So he has 99 names, and that's a lot of names. And there's a lot of things we don't know about our Lord that are within those 99 names. So I want to like figure out what those are. I might even make a video about this um, as Ramadan progresses. My second spiritual goal is I'm going to focus on doing as much taraweeh as I can do. That's the thing with me, like I'll start big and then I'll reduce my prayers as the month goes on and then I'll do less and less and I want to actually start small and do more and more. That's how I, I want it to be, I want to improve myself. So I'm thinking I might slowly increase my tarawi as Ramadan goes on. Another thing I will be doing this Ramadan is I will be doing this series, which is going to be a Ramadan series. I'm going to be posting a video every day, so I'm going to be editing every day as well. Which is going to be difficult. Um, if you really enjoyed this video, please let me know. Uh, leave me a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon on uh, my next video.